Hello, in this video I want to show you how to perform first setup on the Tenda router. And let's begin with our smartphone. And what I'm gonna do is open the Google Play Store and then find an app called Tenda Wi-Fi, uh, install it, after that open the app and here uh, we can let me actually zoom out the camera so we can see out my phone. Uh, after that, uh, log into your account or create a new one. Then allow all of the permissions that will pop up during this setup and uh, we'll be able to add our device right here. Now let's put down our phone and move on to the router. Flip it backwards like this. Then take your internet cable and connect it to the WAN port. Then take the power adapter cable. The power adapter cable should come with this device, it looks like this. And connect it right here. Now we might need to wait around one to two minutes till our router powers on. And we can see if it's actually on by checking the Wi-Fi signal on our phone. So open the Wi-Fi settings on your device and then in available networks keep refreshing it like this and so you can see uh, the Tenda router right here. So now we can see our router, uh, let's connect to one of the networks, 5G or 2.4 band. In this case I'm going with uh, just 2.4. And at the beginning it shouldn't have any password on it. And if there is password, you should be able to find that password on the back of the router, somewhere around this sticker, it might be called SSID or something like that. So now when we are connected with the network and it's always connected right here in the Wi-Fi settings, we can go back to the Tenda app. Then click on add device or if it already finds your router, then we can begin configuration instantly. Start now. Now we can set up the Wi-Fi name and the Wi-Fi password. You can change the name right here, that's the uh, name, and then the password. It needs to have at least eight digits and maximum of a 32. And uh, I'm gonna go with something very simple like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then click on next. Connect Wi-Fi. Now we can uh, Connect with the Wi-Fi network again. Connect it. Let's reconnect then. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the same network that we just configured and enter the previous password. Now go back again, click on connected. Let's keep trying until we manage to actually connect it. If not, I have a fix for that as well. Okay, so if this keeps happening, then just go back to the Wi-Fi settings. And sadly, we'll need to disconnect any other Wi-Fi that we're currently connected to other than the Tenda. So uh, let's go with this 2.4 band Wi-Fi signal that we're gonna disconnect like this. Forget the network. Forget the network. 
Also we can try connecting with the Tenda 5G. And go back and click on connected. Now I think it should work fine. Okay, nice. Let's turn off the Bluetooth and try again. Let's go back one step, click on the router again, control now, enter the admin password and I think it should be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And here's our router. So uh, as you just saw, uh, if you encounter the problem when it keeps saying that uh, the router connection uh, failed, then just go back during this, this problem and then open your router and it should work fine like I have right here. And that's it for this video, hope you like it, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave a like and a comment below.